Okay, it's recording. Okay, it's time for Dungeon 5. I've been marathoning like this whole game. <laughs> like, ah, with like one break. It's cool. I'm having fun. Oh, I remember this one's got an annoying boss. It's that one that keeps running away in it. So I know that if you've got the red tunic, you can kind of glitch it, or it ends too soon. You can end it before you're supposed to or something. Compass! Always a great thing to start with. One more hour. Oh, you're going off in an hour then, Harris. <laughs> you don't even need the last one. Ow. Ow, he threw a bone at me. Well, I've got a bow. Which I will learn to aim. <laughs> it's a good job I got that expansion. in two hours. Uh, how is class doing anyway? Going well? Well, <laughs> just well. Reckless, aren't I? <laughs> Using up way too many arrows. Gotta stop being reckless. <laughs> the beak! I oh, got the stressful stuff out of the way. Nice. Oh, what? You can't jump through the door. Ooh, arrows. Nice. Oh, it's a good job I didn't buy the bow then. It looks like you need arrows. It just spawned a bunch of arrows for me. Oh, no. Oh right, you do have to hook shot unless you... Actually, you can probably just rough through that. They don't knock you back like they did in the deluxe version. The original, they don't really knock you back, they just do damage. Ah, I'll get the hook shot, just to play it safe. Or can I not? I don't think even this game would force us to take damage. Yeah, there must be another route. But yeah, they don't knock you back as far as they used to, so I think it is actually doable. Just brute forcing it through that room. 
If you can't destroy a skeleton, use a bomb. Yeah, no, no. So I'm curious if you can just use bomb arrows on him. I do not remember him being this defensive. Ah, oh, you can only hit him once, down. <laughs> I can't beat you, I'm out of here. Yep. Looks like the colour coded. Ah. Looks like the floor tiles, the colour, because there's one, that's where you're fighting first. So it looks like they've given you some hint as to what order you've got to do it in at least. I've got what was inside this box. Dive under where the torchlight beams cross. Ah, oh, come on, I perfect jump then. Ah, oh, must get the hook shot soon. Because they require the hook shot, don't they? I'll try going back to that other room that I found. That might be where we respawn. Where was it? This is not a fun dungeon. <laughs> right, 
Yeah, she's got four markers, so I think that must be the fourth one. I think that's how it works. And they won't let us cheese him get any more. <laughs> it doesn't look like you can. He used to be able to like bomb out, out but it didn't reset his um, vulnerability. So you could just wail on him with bomb arrows and kill him in like one phase. Well, I'm on half a heart, so might as well use a fair weight. Yeah, two. Here we go. You found me. You're a pesky kid, you know that? Uh -huh. Yeah, you can only hit him once now. Yeah, there's not much to talk about here really, it's a pretty meh dungeon this one. It's just like an annoying chase sequence with this boss. It's, I know it's a bit of quiet video, it's going to be like boring to watch, but yeah. You can give me stuff to talk about on this, because this is not a fun dungeon. <laughs> I need stuff to talk about, help me. Clearly this is why I stream, I need the help. Gotta help me fill this dead end. It's never been one of my favourite dungeons, this one. I wonder if I'd call it the weakest? I don't know if I'd call it the weakest dungeon, because... Um, Six is kind of in there as well. But it's more... Six probably is good, I just don't remember it. I, I really don't remember Dungeon Six. Ow! <laughs> Way too close. I like that, he's a pretty straightforward boss as well. <laughs> and I know where the fourth room is. Map. Hive the map. Oh, I can't leave. Now I can. Bloopers! More Mario. Oh. Actually, yeah, I may as well save and load here, because the fourth one's back at the dungeon entrance, isn't it? May as well load and save myself some time. If you can hit him with your sword, it's not bomb range. <laughs> yep. Didn't we have something like that happened in Pathfinder? Or Pox campaign? Phoenix's campaign. So it happened like that. <laughs> I'm not using a bomb in melee range. Is 
think something like that happened. Do you get hurt if you jump on Goomba? Nah, if you jump on a Goom Goomba, you basically Goomba stomp them. It kills them instantly. Um, if I remember correctly, on the... On normal mode, it's a guaranteed heart, I believe. But I'm playing on um, hero mode, so... I don't know if that's still true or they changed it. Yep, here he is. This should be the final one. Oh. That's new. There we go. Easy. Finally, I can play the dungeon. That's probably the worst part of this, is that you can't even do the dungeon until you hunt that boss down four times. And it's just the same thing. <laughs> Hook shot. It even makes like a little noise. <laughs> Best part of this dungeon is the item. I think that's probably why number six doesn't stick very well in my mind, because Dungeon Six's item is terrible. It's just meh. What we call padding, yeah. That's why I like in the originals you can just skip that bot guy by using the bomb arrow trick. Like I said, I think I've said before. Back in the original, um, he doesn't have the vulnerability period, he just dies. I think I did it in my let's play. Can't remember. Anyway, now I've got the hook shot, I can actually do the dungeon. So let's do the dungeon. Whoopies! You're happy. I may as well use a fairy actually at this point. Because they're not full heals, are they? They're seven hearts. Ah, no mask for you. Starbound Borderlands, they could work, honestly. A few of them could work, really. So I think with Borderlands, I think we're going to be in. I think we're ended up waiting for the Steam release, aren't we? Because nobody's getting it on Epic. <laughs> no one we know is getting it on Epic. Good job, I didn't get the bow then, innit? I forget if the hookshot works on these, or if it has to be done. 
Oh yeah, you can't hookshot them, okay. Just resolve. Oh good, I can't just shield them. Open your eye, please. I wonder what the bomb arrow does. Ow! Okay, yeah, bad idea. I'll just go with the bow, actually. But it's safe with the bow. Yeah, so if they lean forwards, they're going to tackle. Backwards, they're going to spin. That's a tackle. Spin. Tackle. Come on. Come on, open your eye. Ah, oh, one arrow. Can't do two. Oh, that doesn't hurt it? Damn. Didn't look like it did anyway. Come on, open your eye. Come on. Stupid RNG fights. Again. Did I mention how I don't like this dungeon? <sighs> Jeez, finally. Well, I got my warp portal at least. It's kind of pointless because I already proved you can get here already. <laughs> I just came the wrong way around. You have to pay a key to get here and you can already get here. Kind of. Yeah, like I say, it's just boring this one. And now I can't progress. It's that that's it, I can't progress. Despite the fact I can already get here. Jeez. Uh, it's just the the dungeon just feels like it wasn't designed to flow at all. That's, a, that's my main problem with it. It just wasn't designed to flow. I probably wouldn't feel bad saying that this is easily the low point of the game, honestly. I'm not a fan of this dungeon. Oh, 
Oh, you can jump on these guys as well. Huh. Just accidentally did it. Yeah, see, this is... This just takes you here anyway. You don't even have to fight that boss. This is why I'm convinced that this just isn't a well-designed dungeon. I'm half tempted to see if I can just cheese it, see if I can diagonally. Because you couldn't diagonally grapple in the Game Boy 1. Ah! No, I think they, I think they predicted someone might do that. Because look, you can just jump across, you don't even have to do that whole boss fight. It just doesn't... Yeah, just skip getting the key. You don't need the key, just cut the corner somehow. <laughs> I get the feeling some speedrunner is going to find a clip for that, where they can just get through. There's going to be some speedrun strat where somebody avoids that. Okay, I got bit and jumped on it. Can I be done with this dungeon already? I just want to be done with this dungeon, please. <laughs> <laughs> Just stand up in the water. Pose. Okay, that's the big key, but I'm still missing a small key. Ah, oh, there's a bunch of this dungeon that I've still yet to explore. Of course you can't go that way around because that pot's blocking you. Ah. Of course. On. Thank you. I just got ten bombs out of it, but I'm about to die. Yeah, normally I'd probably retreat at this point and go heal, but eh, you guys want efficiency. <laughs> Oh, hang on. This is easy. There we go. Oh, 
Yeah, I figured it out. <laughs> Don't know why it didn't click for me. And now, due to this dungeon's spectacular design, the quickest way is to just save and load. <laughs> Seriously, this is... I don't like this dungeon. Now, let's beat the boss with half a heart. Let's go. Yeah, I know the sensible thing to do is to go out and restock my fairies and heal, but... Eh. That's what smart people do. Clearly, I am prepared for this boss. Yeah, I've got revival powder, I'm fine. Again, I'll try the boss. If it goes bad, back out, heal, try again. Which one is it? Oh, it's the bomb one. Yeah, it's. Oh, no, it's not. It's the. I remember, you've got to go fishing in the wall, so this is going to be annoying. Yeah. Oh boy. Can't wait to see how annoying this one is now. The slime wall. Oh yeah, it does an all, it does that awkward shuffle pause thing. Yeah, this boss is not going to be fun. I've done a fair amount of damage on it already. <laughs> you can kind of go in the hole and poke it. <laughs> Come on. Oh yeah, that's fair. Cover it with the tail so I can't do anything. You don't seem to know what kind of island this is. What a fool. Yeah, I still have one here. Well, not anymore. Victory pit dive? <laughs> I'm healing anyway. Oh, it's 12 hearts. Sorry if I sounded like really not enthusiastic that dungeon, but I'm not enthusiastic at all. <laughs> yep, the face shrine next. Which again, I think is a straightforward entry, isn't it? I don't think anything stops you from entering it. It's just literally straight in. No side quest, nothing. So, you've got plenty of time to explore, I think, on the next bit. So, just going to do some off-camera restock, I think. So, yeah. Going to cut the recording here. And resume it um, next exploration session. <laughs>